In the fight against cancer, more and more researchers are discovering the value of comprehensive methylation studies. DNA methylation is a stable epigenetic modification of the DNA, so it's preserved through clonal evolution. So it's a very reliable means of knowing what cell of origin you're dealing with. Human DNA is known to be methylated, and many of this methylation happens at CPG Island, which is always around the promoter of genes of interest. By studying the dynamics of methylation, we can look at these dynamics, the different dimension of actually how a cancer cells is being formed. Methylation arrays are among the most effective tools for studying this important epigenetic mark, providing comprehensive genome-wide coverage. The research community is now very interested in DNA methylation, particularly because more recently several institutions and several research groups have utilized this technology to develop classification tools that use DNA methylation array data specifically to analyze the, the genomic profile of brain tumors and classify them and accurately diagnose them. These arrays cover a very large proportion of the genome. So we have access to more than 850,000 locations in the genome that could be epigenetically altered at the methylome level. Methylation arrays also enable research on a variety of sample types. Because DNA methylation is a very stable epigenetic mark, we can use it to look at the biological features of archived paraffin-embedded tissue that have been banked many years ago or fresh frozen tissue that have been recently collected and get a very nice and comprehensive view of large set of samples. What's more, workflows for methylation arrays are designed for ease of use. The kits that are available for these arrays are very nicely put together so that the whole process can be done within three to three and a half days and is very user friendly. Methylation arrays are already changing the study of tumors and the future is full of promise. This field is rapidly evolving. Over the past five, 10 years, we have seen a lot of changes and I only anticipate this to be even more exciting more dramatic of a difference in terms of how we understand the biology of these tumors. So get involved and find good mentors and find good questions to answer. And uh, it's good to be a part of making a difference. Add a new dimension to your cancer studies with methylation microarrays. The time is now.